Next tonight, the parents of a teacher from West Yorkshire left in a coma after being beaten up in Thailand say they've been left frustrated and upset with the Thai legal system. A verdict was due today in the trial of Sean Tinsley, the man accused of Adam Pickle's attempted murder, but it was postponed for a second time. Steve Sheard has the latest. Adam Pickles had lived in Thailand for seven years. He worked as an English teacher and had a young son. In May 2012, he was involved in an apparent road rage attack in Pattaya, and it left Adam in a coma. Today, a verdict on the man accused of his attempted murder was postponed for a second time after important legal documents were sent to the wrong court. Speaking on Look North tonight, his parents told us of their frustration that justice hasn't been done. Angry, really, that this could have happened um, when it's gone on for so long. And, you know, it, it has a, a real impact on the family and it's difficult for Andrew and I, all the, the constant ups and downs. Um, it's like an emotional roller coaster, really. The family's MP is offering support, but says there's a limit to what the government can do. But you use the diplomatic processes, you use the ambassadors to make sure that you're working closely with um, those systems to basically say to the Thai government at the end of the day in the judicial process, look, it's in everybody's interest in international relations to make sure that justice is seen to be done and that a just outcome is achieved. Andrew and Adele Pickles have been forced to remortgage their home to pay medical bills of around £130,000. Their only positive news is the recent improvement in their son's condition. He is coming through and we are getting responses from him. Um, he'll, he'll mention, he'll say names and he'll smile and um, indicate to us that he can hear us and that kind of thing. So, so that gives us a lot of hope. The case is now due to be heard in Thailand in mid-September. Steve Sheard, BBC Look North.